I've never enjoyed being uh, uh, boastful, you know, I just uh, don't have that much to boast about. I'm very, very conscious of my, my limitations. Al Broadus is a gentle giant, but he's very humble. He manages to move at the highest levels and yet be so very modest and unassuming. But he is a scholar, he's an accomplished commentator, and he's in demand. He's a very steady presence. More than that, he's a calming presence. One of the most contemplative, thoughtful people that I have ever been associated with. He is motivated by the strongest of values, compassion for people, and appreciation of the strengths and weaknesses of human nature. He's very quick to give credit to other people and very quick to take blame. Just a down-to-earth, likable guy, which is very rare for economists. He has a good heart. I think it has something to do with his childhood and his work ethic. He's not the one on the screen, but he's making the production happen. It's just fun to be with people and, 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 and to interact with people. And if you can kind of do that on the same level, it's just so satisfying. And he brings people together. He's a uh, consensus builder. He's not a divider. Al treats everybody the same. There are no distinctions for Al in terms of how he interacts with others. He was born here, he's lived here for, for many, many years, and he's motivated to give the best that he can to his community. It's amazing that a local boy ended up running the Federal Reserve here in town. Al has pushed the bank and his management of the bank, he pushed the bank to get very involved in the community. He opened the doors to the Federal Reserve Bank and invited minority businesses to come in and learn more about the um, procurement opportunities there. He wants to be able to educate uh, today's young people to understand about the economy so that they can make very good decisions for themselves for the future. Healthcare and education are two objects of his great work. Those causes that he supported on the nonprofit side are much better because of Al's commitment and contributions, and those for profit organizations uh, have done well under his leadership. Al's a critical piece to those successes. If you can work uh, and collaborate as a team, it just, it, it has, it makes it fun and it makes it uh, likely to, to have a better outcome. He is brilliant as an economist, but as I said, he has this wonderful ability to translate it into understandable terms, make these economic theories meaningful to the lives of all of us. He really threw himself into, into his work. And, and did not try and be superior to the people that he was working with. I asked him, was there anything else I could ask you, Mr. Broadus? And he said, yes, stop calling me Mr. Broadus. My name is Al. So he's not out to um, sort of self-aggrandizement. He's out to do the best that his talents can do for his community. He doesn't worry about how it looks or how it sounds if he feels that he's doing the right thing. He takes action. He dives in with both feet. He gets to the bottom and the heart of the matter and is not distracted by a lot of, uh, uh, a lot of paraphernalia on the side. He doesn't take anything for granted. And he knows that people need a pat on the back and he's happy to do it. His leadership style is one of leading by example and not by ego. Uh, his desire would be to sort of bring out the best in everybody. As he does all these other great things, he has never forgotten that his first obligation is to his family. Stop thinking about yourself. Think uh, about what you're trying to do, what other people are involved, what the objective is. He wants to make sure that life here is good for everyone. He's deeply vested in that. Al loves to be a part of the community. He's not one who wants to have the limelight. Like an Eagle Scout. Trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. Al Broadus is 
authentic, he's fair, he's kind, and he's really just a nice guy. <laughs> he's an asset to the community because he's both a brilliant economist and he is a very good man. He could have gone anywhere, uh, but he chose to come back home. And we're so fortunate that he did. I'm sure Al is cringing in his seat as we're saying these nice things about him, um, but that's one of the things that makes Al Al. He is rock solid. You can't have too many guys like Al. This world would be a better place if it had more Al Broadduses in it. I hope everyone in the community who thinks about the community and loves the community is thinking about where we're going and how good it can be.